There is no clear explanation of what makes a person homosexual. Yet 37% of American men and 20% of American women have had some form of homosexual experience since puberty. And reliable statistics conclude that at least one out of every 10 Americans is gay. Today, anti-homosexual statutes are enforced in 23 states, where many homosexuals stand accused of crimes against nature. The men and women presented here speak of prejudice, of pride, and of being homosexual. I would like all the people who are watching this film to just sit back and listen and stop holding the arms of their chairs with white knuckles. I would like to plead with them to just understand that people are different and everybody deserves to be happy. themselves people who have a different lifestyle. We do not believe this is an accurate description. We say they have a death style. They call us faggots, queers, bitches, whores, prostitutes. How does that make you feel? I knock the shit out of them. <laughs> For those who have observed them. Don't let the high heels fool you. I still fight like a man. But there's nothing gay about these people. They are a tragic group of people. They pose a moral danger and threat to the vitality of a community and a nation. Don't tell me it's a lifestyle. It's a death style, and these people are dangerous when they don't get their lust satisfied. Teresa, they are very willing to say, yes, I'm a lesbian, yes, I love other women. Ruby and the Dancer wasn't a song written specifically about lesbianism, but that is a very important part of who they are. Oh, if you're looking for my heart, pass me by. I can remember when I first had sex with another boy. I was seven. Uh, and he just gradually became aware that I was gay. Uh, I didn't know what it was. I was it a long time before I was gay. And it all came so natural, moving on angels' wings. Oh, but truly I knew me when my life was gay. Your initial reaction to the fact that your child is gay is that you you immediately hope it's not so I was wrong not for me but because you know that life is going to be a little bit harder oh, will you take me with you now oh, well, I remember walking down the street with uh, a woman who is so dear to me, and I love her very much. And we're, we're very close friends. And we were walking down the street, and I said, uh, by the way, I want you to know that I'm homosexual. And she turned to me, and she said, oh, thank God. I thought you didn't know. I am not gay. out the front door and the flash bulbs went off and two people took us by the arms and right into the paddy wagon and they booked us all on this wonderful charge called crimes against nature and disturbing the peace they have no way. 